Hi everyone, this is the Magic Ball Base. First I'm going to do the performance, then I'm going to teach you how to do it. Let's see what we have inside. Okay, we have a red ball. Now what I'm going to do, since there's nothing here and nothing here, I'm going to take the red ball and just put it into my pocket and take and cover up the vase just like this. Now if I just wave my hand over it and say hocus pocus, hopefully we can make the ball reappear just like magic. Now people ask me all the time, Dave, can you make the ball disappear? Absolutely. If you just snap your fingers like this, it completely vanishes and it ends up back inside my pocket. That's the performance of the magic ball base. Now I'm going to teach you how to do it. Now when you purchase this trick, you get the ball, you get the regular base, you get the top and you also get the gimmick. Yes, there's a gimmick. And what it basically is, a red ball cut in half glued on here. Okay? So when you get this effect, you're going to get the top. Top fits on top of the gimmick. You get, of course, the red ball and the base. Now when you start this effect, it's very important um, that you understand where to grab it to bring the gimmick up. You notice the gimmick ring is right here, so when you grab it here, you've got the gimmick. When you want to leave the gimmick showing with your left hand, if you're right-handed, you hold on to the gimmick, and then when you lift it like this, the gimmick is now on top. Okay? So for the performance, I show, you know, very casually, that there's a regular ball, you can put it in your pocket, show there's nothing here, let them wave their hand over it, or you can wave your hand over it, and then of course you make the ball appear. Now it's important not to move that too much or they'll wonder why the ball's not moving. You show that the ball appeared there, you wave your hand over it again, hocus pocus, it disappeared, and it's, guess what, it's over here in my pocket. Now another thing you can do, of course, is if you had this ball, I guess you could palm it, like that and hold this like this and you could show this empty and then you could have them, them touch the top and the second they touch it the ball could fall on the table. So there's many different things that you can do with this effect once you understand how to do the secret move which is either hold on to the gimmick or or excuse me, hold on to the gimmick or not hold on to it. Okay? Because when you're, excuse me, when you're holding on to it, it's going to be up here, it won't show. And when you're not holding on to it over here, it will show. So once you understand that principle, there's many different things you can do with this. And it's a great little effect. It will run you most likely about 4 or $5. And this is kind of a cheaper plastic one. They might have nicer ones in aluminum if you want to spend some more money. Have a great day. Once again, this is David Castle, president of LearnMagicTricks.org, and this is the demonstration and tutorial of the Magic Ball Base.